Hello and welcome to Maths Plus. We're on the 2021 Leave Insert Ordering Level Paper 2 Question 3. A line in passes through the two points, A and B, and we need to get the equation in this form, y is equal to mx plus c. So the first step would be to attain m, which is our slope. So let's start off with our slope. So y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. Now we're going to assign x1, y1 to our points x1, y1, x2, y2. Substitute everything in. And let's work out the slope. So y2 is minus 2. y1 is 2. So it's 2 minus 2. All over 0 minus minus 1. So just be careful with your signs. And we will get a total of minus 4 for our slope. Okay, so m is equal to minus 4. So now we go to our line formula. y minus y1 is equal to m by x minus x1. We can choose either point. Let's choose point A for x1, y1. So y minus 2 is equal to minus 4 by x minus minus 1. Okay, so this will give us a plus 1. So let's keep writing this out. So y minus 2 is equal to minus 4x. It's a plus 1 in here. Plus 1. Okay, so minus 4 by plus 1 is minus 4. Bring the 2 over. And therefore, we will get a y is equal to mx plus c output of minus 4x for mx and a minus 4 plus 2, which is a, a minus 2. It's part A. Let's look at part B now. So in the diagram below, we have a line 3x minus 4, y is equal to 5. And we have a point P down here, 6 minus 3. So we need to find the equation of the line K, which is perpendicular to line L. So first of all, let's do a plan. We need to get the slope of this line. Then we're going to get the inverse slope, which is going to be M inverse, or M perpendicular, which will go through point P, Okay, we'll use that slope and we'll use point P as x1, y1 as a point on line K. Okay, so let's put it all together. So the slope of L we need to rearrange it so y is equal to mx plus c. And when we rearrange it, we can see the slope. So we can bring over the 3x. So we get minus 4y is equal to minus 3x plus 5. Okay, that's rearranged. So therefore, we can divide across by our minus 4, and we will get minus 3 over minus 4 x plus 5 right so that slope there is going to be 3 over 4 the perpendicular slope is the inverse 
So in perpendicular is equal to minus 4 over 3. Let's put that into our line formula and let's put this point into our, our line formula as well. So therefore the line K can be written as follow. y minus y1 is equal to mx minus x1. Our slope there is minus 4 over 3. Okay, be sure that's the slope you put in because we cannot put in the last one because that would be parallel. So we're going perpendicular. Okay, on k. All right, so we put in that point in. So it'll be x minus... 6 and over here y minus minus 3 that's a plus 3 multiply across and we will get 3y plus 9 is equal to minus 4x plus 24 bring everything to one side and we will get 4x plus 3y plus 9 minus 24 is minus 15 and that will be line k okay on to the next one so we need to get the point of intersection of these of two lines okay so the two lines are 3x minus 4y is equal to 5 and the second line is 2x minus y is equal to 10 so L and H so to find the point of intersection we need to get the simultaneous equations and solve for x and y so x and y will be the point of intersection can write his shorthand like that okay so what will we do well let's look at the numbers we can multiply the bottom line by 4 and change the sign so let's do that let's pay attention to the numbers so 3x minus 4y is equal to 5 that's staying as is h now will become 8x minus 4y is equal to 40 change the signs so i'm going to change the signs of the top line here so minus plus and minus okay so that's multiplied by minus one so we have a plus 4y and a minus 4y they cancel when you add the two lines together and we get 5x is equal to 35. Therefore, x is equal to 7. So to get the y value, we substitute back in. So let's choose line h. So we get 2 by 7 minus y is equal to 10. You can see this is the line I'm using here. So you could use any line. Now we're going to get minus y is equal to 10 minus 14. y is equal to minus 4. Therefore, y is equal to plus 4. Minus y is equal to minus 4. y is equal to plus 4. Change the sign of both sides. So the coordinate of intersection of h and k is 7 4 and we can write it like this l intersection k thank you for joining maths plus